Sarah still doesn't feel good today. And instead of buying her flowers, I'm gonna fix your toilet. You hate to swim? I hate to! I'm teasing as. Maybe swimming will cook this head cold out of me. Mom, I'm kidding. I'm going to help out my garden because I've definitely been neglecting it. And it is so sad. It's beautiful out here this morning and I am going to help out my garden because I've definitely been neglecting it. And it is so sad. Look at this poor thing. The pomegranates decided to go on this one. Interesting. So as you can see, needs lots of help this morning. And it's interesting. I wonder why those other pomegranate bush bushes didn't get any pomegranates on it this year. Okay, garden cleaning time. This bed right here was so hard because we hadn't pulled any weeds at all this year. So they had just grown and grown and grown. The tomato plants are doing amazing. The strawberry plants are doing great. Watermelon came back. Doesn't look like the blueberry plant made it. Zucchini is amazing. The carrots are growing. The cucumbers are all nice and green now. The mint is insane. And even the basil is growing a little bit. So but the garden is some work and it's worth it. It's so fun to see things grow. It's so fun to watch the fruits of our labor. I have had this plant for quite a long time and it's growing, but not really thriving and I'm not sure if that dirt has any nutrients left inside of it. So I'm gonna add some more dirt and add another vine and hopefully it will start thriving and getting the nutrients that it needs. Oh, I'm also gonna add some plant food, plant food to it. All right, there it is. set that works properly and the one that I took the gears off of. This is what it was happening. Time to fix the pool. Okay, I fixed the cassette and uh, now it's time to turn on the system and see if it actually worked. I was up till two o'clock this morning working on this thing. So we'll see if it works. I could, I could not get those two to work yesterday. So look at that, they're working. Got some down at the bottom that are working. We have an in-floor cleaning system, which is like a sprinkler system that pushes the all of the dirt, debris, and stuff to the from the bottom over to the to the uh, drain, and uh, it hasn't it hasn't done that in a long time. And um, now that we're using it more and it's the pool's open, we need that to be working. And there's areas where it didn't it didn't work for a long time and, and during the winter, and it just kind of stained and stayed there. So we're gonna have to clean that. It looks like it's uh, it's functioning properly. Sweet. I have been propagating those plants for a long time so that I could give one to Danielle and to Mara for their birthdays. The only problem is if I give it to Danielle for her birthday, Mara will know. So I'll just have to give them to each of them for Danielle's birthday and tell Mara it's for her birthday. So, but I think they turned out cute. All ready to be propagated. This right here is my favorite plant. This one was given to us, my mom gave it to us when my grandpa passed away. I actually think this is two plants mixed together. We had one plant that my mom gave us from my grandpa's funeral. So when Branson was 10, so like 16 years ago. And then the other plant that I think is mixed together with this was given to us from Johnny's work when we moved into our new house right before Savannah was born. So 16 years ago. So this plant, is 16 years old. I mean, 
some part of this plant, probably this tree is 16 years old. But that's how long we've had this plant and it's my favorite one because it's just beautiful and amazing. You hate to swim? You don't like to swim? We're gonna swim, but not right now. Why do you hate to? Don't hate to! You hate to swim? I'm teasing as he wanted to get up and shower first. It's like, okay, why? But okay, whatever. And uh, it's time to swim. Why shower before you swim? Whatever, it's, uh, it's up to him. So this is the vlog where you've already seen me and Sarah just up doing our thing. It's a Saturday morning for us and uh, there's just not a lot of activity upstairs until about 10 minutes ago and it got kind of crazy. We let him sleep in today. I think this is the perfect morning to eat breakfast with my feet in the pool. It's getting serious now. The only problem is that water is not cool. 88 degrees. It is happening. The umbrella's in. The water's amazing. It's time to swim. Maybe swimming will cook this head cold out of me. That will work, right? My sourdough start, this one has been in the fridge. I only got out one right now because it's a lot of work to have two. This one has been in the fridge for uh, at least a week and I'm gonna put it outside to give it some extra, extra warmth and see how it goes. I don't wanna let it boil over, but I do wanna let it go to almost boiling point out here and then I'll take it inside. Everyone drinks, so I have. Kayin uh, wants a pom some pomegranate water, so we'll start with that. Okay, um, mine, as is Dad's Ganyans. Snacks for everyone. Chips and cucumber salsa, the best salsa. Ever. Oh, I'm MKD. Whoa, I'm kidding. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I think it's a man kidding. All right. My start has been outside for like four hours. Two, seven, six, five hours. Smell it. <laughs> Stinks. It's good. It's strong. It is strong. You want to smell? You guys remember? There's how many? How many in the comments below? How many of you actually found us by watching the flood video? This is the window that busted. And if you watch the flood video, you'll you'll know that it did not look like this before. In fact, this is where the camera was right here when that flooded through that wall that wall right there was not there to that point right there that wall wasn't there. That door wasn't there um, all of the cabinets were here the fridge wasn't there none of this was in here and uh, that door was over that way more this drain wasn't here if that drain was there probably wouldn't have had an issue um, but there's uh, always lizards and scorpions and grasshoppers in here. Uh, I'm not gonna open it right now, but yeah. In the comments, how many of you, that was your first video ever watching that? That was a crazy time. Three and a half years ago, I think is what it was. Watts has changed, actually. This whole area has completely changed. Go back to the video, check it out, see how much different all of this is. There used to be a kitchen over there. This kitchen was completely different at the time. All of this was different, the fireplace was different, there was carpet in here, which actually got wet. 
Okay. So different. Sarah still doesn't feel good today. And instead of buying her flowers, which is an option still, still an option, I'm gonna fix her toilet. Because no woman who doesn't feel good should not have a toilet. And this thing hasn't been working properly. Time to fix it. And it's been seriously like this for months. I've put it off way too long. This part right here needs to be put in it. I'm not certain that this is gonna fix it. This is what the company said would fix it. I'm actually not too confident in it because I messed around with it a little bit, but I'm gonna go ahead and switch it out anyway. And if it doesn't work, then we'll let them know. If it does work, great. All right, it's all back in place. Water back on. Okay, plug it back in. My guess is it's not gonna work right. Okay, flush. Nope. That part did not fix the problem. I had already previously tested to see if it was this part and it did not prove to be correct. But anyway, they sent the part and said, this will fix it. We didn't fix it. So back to the drawing board. So? Guess what? Well, you're number one, you're a lobster. <laughs> Guess what? So what? It didn't work. It didn't work? I told you it was, I told you I already went through the testing and found that that wasn't the problem, but so that you could tell them, sorry, that didn't fix it. All right. So Still doesn't work right. what do we do? Uh, go back to your traditional toilet and throw it in the garbage. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna see if this worked. I, I put pineapple in one, vanilla in the other. We're gonna make dough whip, we're gonna try it. Oh my gosh, my, my cold is coming in. Okay, we're gonna see if this works this time. Okay, let's see. Look. Mmm, tastes good. What should we put in this? Chocolate chips? All right, try the ice cream. Should I put the in it? I put chocolate chips in it already. Oh, you did? Pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. Okay, now we'll try the sorbet. This one, I don't know if it's frozen. Mm. That one's good. So that one is just canned pineapple and pineapple juice frozen and then put in the, the sorbet setting. So don't whip. It's delicious. All right, woohoo, we had success in the Ninja Creamy. The first one I used milk, vanilla protein powder, and chocolate chips. And then the second one was pineapple, canned pineapple, and pineapple juice. The vanilla one was more like soft serve because I didn't freeze it for quite 12 hours, which is fine for me because I like soft serve better than other ice cream, but if I would have done it 12 hours, I think it would have been more ice creamy, more solid. I think everybody liked it, so I won't throw the Ninja Creamy in the garbage. Well, I thought I was getting better, but tonight doesn't really feel like it. <laughs> I like need to sneeze. But I did make sourdough bread. Well, sourdough. Sourdough dough. <laughs> so I can make bread tomorrow. I feel pretty good during the day. It's at night that it's really bad, so we love you guys. And as always, you are worth it. You are it. worth it. Bye.